too, this because I understand there was a theft in Crown Heights not too long ago, uh, and uh, there was another large theft in the Midwest. Yeah, I mean, uh, so, uh, all I can tell you is from my conversations uh, this morning, they are working, they are on top of it. I, I can't say, I, I won't say anything more. You know, we've, we've got a great police department here in our community, and they've sent people from the outside. They are doing whatever they need to do to, to hopefully, uh, you know, again, these are five Torahs. Uh, they're, you know, they're, <laughs> you know, what do you do with a Torah? They, 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 are, they, they are, I just literally just spoke to the chief's office. They're, they are treating this as the most serious of, of criminal offenses, and they've, they're not sparing any resources. As just mentioned, they, they brought in the equivalent of their CSI to come and to fingerprint and to interview. They're literally doing everything in their power to try to solve this crime, and we're very grateful for, for that. We're grateful for them reaching out and uh, working with us hand in hand. Yeah, it's also the kind of thing, you know, that, uh, you know, we had a rash in the past. We don't want to, as you pointed out, we don't want, you know, you know, you get away, people here, $250,000, you know, a lot of people are desperate out there, you know. The next thing you know is uh, it's happening in a lot of different places. So, God's help, you get you get whoever's responsible and puts an end to it. Good to see you, buddy. Thank you very much. Good to see you, man. Wow. <laughs>